Hello and welcome to another episode of Granite Shorts. Today we're going to discuss the different surface finishes that can be applied to the stone. And what you see behind me is an unfinished uh, backside of a granite slab. Okay, let's go check out the other side. So here we have this beautiful black absolute slab and what a difference from the back of it. It was completely gray on the other side and now it's a rich deep black, very saturated. And that's what you get from the polished finish. This is a completely polished surface. It's as close to a mirror finish as you can get. To achieve the surface, when the slabs are at the quarry, uh, they go through a process of polishing and diamond polishing pads are used of various levels uh, from the very rough to the very fine ones and basically they smooth out the surface until it's glossy. The polished finish is the most popular finish out there especially for granite and that's because it brings out the most of the color from the stone it's very contrast uh, enhancing. It's also very practical because it's hygienic and very easy to clean. This is to show you just how reflective the surface finish is. Now, let's check out another one. What we have here is a honed finish. And now this is the same exact stone as we have just seen. But this one is more gray than black. And that's because the surface here is not reflective. It's slightly dull. So the different types of finishes will affect how the color of the stone would look like. The more uh, finished, the more polished the stone is, uh, the more contrast and the more saturation you will get out of the stone and the rougher the surface is it will become more dull. So there's no reflection here and this uh, type of a uh, surface finish is often used in country kitchens um, also some contemporary kitchens or uh, bars actually and uh, it has a very appealing look to it. It's a very smooth surface. And the next surface finish that we have here is flame finish and this is the same stone that we've just looked at in the previous two slabs this is absolute black as well and the difference here is that the surface is very very rough this finish is achieved by passing a high intensity flame over the surface of the stone which causes uh, some of the minerals in it to pop out of it and that leaves a very rough finish because of its very rough surface, it's great for outdoors, for walkways or stairs. It's, it's really non-slippery. And here we have a very beautiful decorative finish. This is called the water finish or a, a river wash. The surface here is very uneven and that's because water under high pressure is passed over the surface and it washes out the softer minerals from the stone, leaving the hard ones exposed. It's a really interesting texture. It's really uneven, but still smooth. And here we have the sandblasted finish. It's similar to the home finish as far as the looks go, but when you feel it, it's a little bit more rough. It's not as smooth. The way the surface finish is created is by shooting a stream of sand onto the surface which kind of blasts away little particles of the stone. Another decorative finish, this is a brushed finish. A roll of brushes, a metal brush goes over the surface of this rather soft stone, slate in this case, and it leaves very uh, nice grooves in the stone. And here we have a decorative but still very practical finish. This is the leather finish. It's a textured finish that's brushed to achieve a much smoother surface. These are just some of the surface finishes that are available, but they're also some of the more popular ones. Thank you for watching Granite Shorts, and I'll see you next week.